You want to get married and to have peace in the... She's going to make you pieces, to cut you to pieces. You're not going to have peace, you're going to have pieces in your house. You cannot have slow bite. To, to have slow bite, you need to have a heart. You need to have sensitivity. You need to care. You need to love. You need to have a heart. You need to be humble. You need to be able to listen to rebukes, to what did she got to tell you. If she's talking to you about one thing again and again and again, and you cannot hear it because you're occupied, because you're busy, because you have to complete your tshuva, and you have to finish the nikuta alachot, and you have to do shas, and you have to once a week, at least once a week, to do six hours. But, Mama, you want to be tzaddik. I'm not saying a criminal wants to go to the pubs to drink vodka with his friends. I'm not talking about that. No, not at all. Righteous man. You want to serve Hashem, you want to commit yourself to Abadat Hashem. Every day you have to be the right time in the mikveh and then in the, in the, in the yeshiva and the kole and, to, and, and, and Friday you want for the panasah. You have to have a set of um, tzorayim also to learn at night and evenings and on and on. And, uh, and it's only for Abadat Hashem. No, we talked about it before that you, want, you wanted me to be a friend. Listen, she wanted a friend. Someone to talk to her, someone to listen to her, someone to walk, to cross life with her, someone to give her a hand, someone to support her, someone to give her good words. If you're not able to do that, and you want someone to... So, so you need a husband. You don't need a wife. If you want someone to support you and to tell you how good you are, all of those obligations are for a husband. It's not for a wife. If you need a wife that's always going to hug you and going to kiss you and going to support you and go to Mamash, be there for you. So you need a husband. You don't need a wife. You're a woman. You don't have the ability to give. You don't have the ability to support and to be there for her and to love her and to appreciate her and to talk to her and to give her from your time. And, and, and if you don't have it, so you cannot have some by it. Two women in the house, it cannot work. It's not happening. Forget it. It's uh, only in San Francisco it can work. Here in Eretz Israel, it's not working. It's not working in Eretz Israel. It's not working in Eretz Israel. In Eretz Israel, it's a place of Kedusha. Only holiness. And in holiness, in Kedusha, there are rules. The rules is that you receive your Shefa from Hashem Barach and you give it to your wife. And your wife, she receives it from you and she gives it to the children. And this is how the Shefa comes down.